what is the brand the brand is paper towel let's be real their caramel apple it's like the fall edition It's currently 5.40 on a Saturday. That's a.m., not p.m. Like waking up at 5.40 a.m. on a Saturday is literally insane. However, this is like my only option. Okay, let me just explain what's been going on and why it's been so long since the last time y'all seen me because i haven't vlogged since tuesday it's saturday so my baby has been sick she's been very clingy like no one else in the world exists to her in this moment but me i'm 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 her world so i haven't been able to get anything done my house looks a mess my kids were home on friday so it looks even more of a mess because they had the entire day to mess it up. I've been up actually since like 4.30. So I've been up for a little over an hour and I was trying to go back to sleep and I couldn't go back to sleep. And I was like, I gotta get up anyway to get this house clean. So let me just do this now. So on the agenda today is waking up at the crack of dawn to get the house clean. And then I'm gonna go to a grocery order pickup at seven. I'm taking the, doc the baby back into the doctor today because I think that now she has an ear infection. And at some point during the day, I want to take my kids to the library because we always kind of do this around fall. Like fall is my favorite time of year. I'm so excited. I'm going to take the kids to the library and we're going to check out some Halloween books and grab a couple of DVDs because we watch movies in the car. Like, let me just tell y'all that like taking your kids to the library is like one of the most underrated activities to do with your kids. It's free. The kids love it. It's educational. Like, I used to do this all the time. Oh yeah. And then at noon, I have a rental. So after my rental is done at noon, I told my whole family, don't even look at me. I'm done. Okay. Don't talk to me. Don't look at me. Don't come in my room. I'm unavailable. Until dinner. Because I have to cook dinner. But yeah. So that's what we're doing today. I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, TT, two-turn baby girl, you know me, still with the dolls that I grew beside, all the niggas brown, me, I and I got it, gotta watch the time, cause it's flying right by, I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, TT, two 
time, baby girl, you know me Who am I? All the niggas around me, why do they die? Gotta watch the time, cause it's fine right now I just caught a shorty off a fame and stuff Just the one I'm really a supreme shot Way that I've been living, I'm conventional I'm just trying to make it to the end, you know Certain things have started getting pissed off Think we need to have a sun and finish up I could be a man, but maybe down the road Right now, I would rather see my heart turn to chrome Rather see my heart turn crystal I can't even find a ground mission Right now, I'm just stuck inside a crib on my own Soon as I freak up, I'm about to pop up on your phone Like, I'm outside in an AMG Right outside Baby girl, you know me. Please select the payment. Please check your receipt. Alright, we are having the most productive day ever. It is 7.26 and I'm getting my car washed. <sighs> Adulting today like a mother. Literally. Good morning, I'm picking up a mobile order for Jamie. Yes, ma'am, just go ahead and close to the window, please. Thank you. Thank you. Do you need a troll? No, thank you. We're back. Okay. Okay, anyway, we're back. So let me go through this quickly because I hear the baby upstairs, which means that I don't have no more me time. Had to go give me a little Starbies. And I got the white chocolate mocha frappuccino with one pump of hazelnuts. Yeah. That's it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Get you some. From my husband. I just got him like a ice white chocolate mocha. I got him the ice drink because he sleep. I'm sure he's sleep right now. So um, I don't want it to get all watered down and stuff like that. So I just had to make it with no ice. Anyway, I got the ham and cheese croissant with some avocado spread. So fire. And then I got the kids some cake pops. And of course, because it's fall, I had to do the owls. They'd be so cute. Low key, I wanted one for myself, but I was like, I'm already getting two. I'll just like theirs. <laughs> so before I get into the haul from today, I just wanted to show y'all these cookies that I got the other day. And they're caramel apple. It's like the fall edition. If you can't tell, I'm digging fall. Like, I used to be a spring girl, summer girl, whatever. Moved to Texas, definitely a fall girl. Like, Texas fall is so bomb. It's so hot like all year that like once it finally cools down, you can actually enjoy being outside. You can do all the outside activities that you couldn't do during the summertime because it's too hot. It's literally too hot to go outside. It's starting to cool down, but cool down for Texas means like 80s and 90s. It's still hot just a couple weeks ago it was like 107 degrees outside so yeah anyway i got paper towels i get the cheapy cheap paper towels because why am i paying for something i'm just for, I, I buy them to, to throw them away the the purpose of buying paper towels is to throw them away so why would i buy expensive ones i always get the cheapest ones the little walmart brand ones well they're thing with walmart brand what is the brand the brand is paper towel Let's be real. I got some, I'm not gonna take them off this bag because I wanted to stay in here. Some boneless, skinless chicken thighs. I'm gonna be making some teriyaki chicken and jasmine rice with broccoli. So I got some broccoli. Broccoli florets. Here comes the children. They haven't seen me all day. That's the boy. Got some cinnamon French toast. These are fire. The kids love them. 
always my go-to breakfast. Like when I don't feel like cooking and stuff. Got me two different types of mochi. I have both of them are strawberry, but they're two different brands. I want to see which one I like better. I like mochi. Um, so I was watching McKenna the other day. If y'all don't watch McKenna Walker, y'all sweet. I love her. She's absolutely my favorite YouTuber. So anyway, I was watching her the other day and she was just saying that she was gonna get her some mochi because she was on her cycle. <laughs> it's like her cycle today. And I was like, yeah, mochi sounds fire right about now. So got me two packs. Notice I said my son is woken. He still ain't came in here to come say hi to me. He clearly hears me in here talking to y'all. He's playing with it all. I think that's a mess. Cheez Its for the children for their snack. Some hamburger helper because I have a pack of ground beef in the freezer that I have not cooked and I don't have a meal to go with it. And it's literally just been sitting there for like the last few months. So I'm like, I need to go ahead and find something to cook this week before. It just gets freezer burnt and goes bad. So, corned beef hash, that's always good for breakfast. Um, some reduced sodium soy sauce, that is for the chicken teriyaki that I'm gonna be cooking. <sighs> so disappointing. I bought green apples because I wanted to do caramel apples with the kids, but they were out. What is that? They were out of caramels. So they tried to substitute caramels with Twix. I'm like, that's not a substitution. So anyway, I just told them no, I didn't want the Twix. So I have to go in the store because I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure they have caramels. I'm pretty sure they have caramels. Sometimes I swear if what I put in my cart is like hard to find or if they're on one side of the store and what they're supposed to be eating is on the other side of the store, they just be like, oh, it's not available. Like I swear, cause I go in the store and they have it. Nine times out of 10, they have it. Anyway, chicken ramen, and it's Halloween theme. <laughs> so cute. Some Raid for flying insects. If you have seen my vlogs before, you know I have a healthy fear of insects. I do not like killing them because I don't want to hear them crunch. So, I always, always, always use spray. I live by this stuff, y'all. It kills on contact immediately, every time. Um, some dryer sheets, the blue sparkle scent. I bought some cinnamon toothpaste for the children. They don't like using the mint toothpaste, but their breath has outgrown the children's toothpaste. So we set up for cinnamon. Double stuffed golden Oreos. If you know, you know. I've been hooked. Some matcha latte so I can make my own matcha at home. Vanilla iced coffee. Honey butter biscuits sandwich bags, blueberry lemonade, caramel waters. Hi, mommy. Hi, good morning. And some cinnamon raisin English muffins. And then right on brand for fall, I got some caramel apple suckers. You always get them. Yep, I do. Mm -hmm. Candy corn. The pumpkin. Okay, and then I got the autumn mix. So putting these in like a little cute Halloween dish. Put all the candy out instead of I love fall. Like y'all gonna hear me say this like thirty thousand times. Junior! Uh, -huh. uh are you gonna come tell me good morning or are you just gonna play by yourself all day? Good morning, mommy. From there you you're not gonna give me a hug or nothing? <laughs> so there's a story behind that. Let me just explain to y'all why my son just told me he ain't going nowhere. So Fatty has this thing where he likes to give hugs constantly, all day, hugs. every day. Yeah, he yeah. He's saying he loves hugs. Oh, so we had to like set boundaries with him, with him, and we're like, okay, stop hugging people unless you're just seeing them like if you're just coming to their house then you can hug them and if you're getting ready to leave then you can hug them other than that there's no reason for you to constantly be hugging people so this just dude just told me like i ain't going nowhere okay i'm gonna put away these groceries is today still asleep uh, sure. you didn't hear okay good i need to get her up soon because she got a doctor appointment at 10. i'm gonna take her and go get her ears shut mm -hmm. So anyway, I'm going to put these groceries away. Like I said, Tanae has a doctor's appointment in like an hour and a half. Um, so I think she might have an ear infection. She, so, okay. 
the fever is gone she's not throwing up anymore she does still have a little bit of diarrhea but it's starting to clear up she doesn't show any more signs of dehydration because like her lips were really dry and stuff the other day her skin looked like kind of dry and dull and everything so i knew that she was starting to get dehydrated from the fever and the vomiting and all of that stuff whatever so i've been giving her pediolite and she's she's gotten a lot better so like i said no outward signs of illness anymore like, but it's just the fact that like she's still super clingy and she's still super fussy like she'll be sitting there she'll be fine for a while and then out of nowhere she'll just start screaming and like the cry that she's crying is almost like a i'm in pain cry so that's why i think that now maybe she has an ear infection when i took her in last time they did say that her right ear looked dull it didn't look like it was infected but it did look dull and i seen her mess up with her right ear the other day so i'm like is this an ear infection or what is it i know usually a fever comes along with the ear infection but she had a fever already she just doesn't have one now so i'm like i googled it they said that you can have an ear infection without a fever so i'm like well maybe with her being sick and everything and the congestion that she had previously it's kind of caused an ear infection now so i just want to be you know they say better safe than sorry i don't want her to be sitting around here in pain if she doesn't have to be and if she needs to get on antibiotics i want to do the asap so i'm gonna take her in today at 10 to get her checked out to make sure that she's okay oh yeah and she's eating again because she wasn't really eating any solids like no baby foods or anything like that she would she would nurse but even nursing like i would have to kind of coerce her to nurse like i would have to like try and open her mouth and then it was hard to get her to latch and everything which is usually never an issue so that's how i knew something was going on but anyway i'm gonna get this this um stuff put away and then i'll see you in a minute i'm gonna show y'all proof that kids don't like having a clean house Mhm. Mm well this is just a house that we're making mm -hmm. oh, oh. Oh, yeah, that's a I swear, nobody in this house likes cleanliness except for me. The dog just got a bag yesterday. Look at her. Come here, Cash. Look at her back. Ridiculous. Why do you look like that? What were you doing? The only thing you were supposed to be doing was peeing and coming right back in the house. Why are you so dirty? I cannot. I can't stand these people in this house. <laughs> Okay, it's currently 8.50. I am about to do my Spanish homework real quick because last week on Tuesday, my aunt, that sounds so weird. I don't never say I say auntie. My auntie um, was teaching the class and she gave us homework. So I have to write, originally she said 10 sentences, but she, she downed it to five because she was like, I don't want to have to grade all that homework. So now we have to do five sentences. Can I help you with something? No, I'm just trying, I was like, well, this homework was tied to you on Tuesday and you're now doing it on Saturday. Because I got three kids and my baby was sick. Can I help you with anything else? All right, let me use this gun. Okay, so we got some Halloween theme movies. So we got Caroline. We got Casper and the Adams family. And yeah. then we just got um Betty wants to see the new Super Mario Brothers movie. So 
this one is we're just gonna watch this in the house we'll probably watch this one tonight and then um we're gonna watch these in the car because we always watch movies like especially on the way to school we always watch movies well, we can watch <laughs> Oh, yeah. Okay, Tiana said we could watch the Super Mario movie tomorrow for the breakfast charcuterie. Breakfast charcuterie. Oh my god, I can't stop. Because you have the uh, DVD player in your Yeah, I got it. We have a DVD player in our room. Yes, I know. I don't want to hear about it. Well, we still watch old. DVDs. Yeah, because apparently DVDs are outdated. <laughs> anyway, uh, we bought some. Ball. We borrowed some Halloween books. So this is the Scarecrow's new clothes. Bats at the library. Fright Club. The Monster's Monster. There was an old lady that swallowed a ghost. I love these books. Tiana found this one. I found that one too. Campfire Ghost Stories. Yeah, Tiana found this one too. I found a lot of them. Yep. I think you found one. Um, Monster Itch Ghost Attack, and then I got a couple of books for Tanea too. So we got Pete the Cat, um, Happy Halloween, and then this one is Ollie's Halloween. Yeah, last Halloween I was pregnant with her and I painted my stomach like a pumpkin. Well, my mom painted my stomach like a pumpkin, whatever. Um, they had some free bookmarks, so they gave them a bookmark and then I think Yana had grabbed a, another bookmark too that they had sitting out. Did you grab a bookmark? I put in one of the books up there. Hello? Okay. Alright. Um, You can go ahead and load them up. I have the rental agreement ready. I can email it to you to have them sign it. Alright. Well, I'm on my way. Okay. Alright. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Look who it is. Say hi. She's learning how to wait, y'all. Say hi. Can you say hi? Can you wait? Say hi. Can you wait? Of course, she doesn't want to do it now. It's much later. I did take her to the doctor before I took the kids to the library, but I forgot to update y'all. So they said that she does not have an ear infection. Thank God. They said that she's probably just recovering from whatever the virus was that she may have had because they don't know exactly what virus it was. They, they said, she said that there was a few viruses going around that she could have possibly had. Oh, now you want to wave? Say hi. Hi. <laughs> say hi. Tanea, say hi. Okay. Just gonna smack my boo. Got it. All right. Anyway, uh, yeah. So no ear infection. Thank God. We're happy about that. We don't want any ear infections. So I'm starving right now. Um, the only thing I had today was that ham and cheese croissant from uh Starbucks, and then I had a cheddar bay biscuit that I had made the other day with dinner, and that's all I ate. So I'm starving. So I'm about to cook dinner. I'm gonna fry some catfish and macaroni and cheese. I don't really know what else. I don't know what vegetable I wanna do. I'll figure that out because I don't really think I have many options for vegetables right now. I have some green beans. What well, y'all don't care. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, so I'm finna eat. I'm finna cook. I'ma eat. It's two o'clock. I already told them once I go upstairs after I cook dinner. Don't come check it for me. Don't talk to me. The only person I want to see for the rest of the day is this one right here. That's it. The older ones, they can fend for themselves. Actually, they daddy here, so if they need something, they can go to him. See, I'm finna disappear on them. I'm clocking out. I'm clocking out. Yeah. Yeah. We about to clock out. Say bye. Wait, how do you do this? Mwah.